So you think that person that committed homicide, double homicide, triple homicide is getting out on their good behavior? I don't think so. Matter of fact, some of those people are getting the death penalty because of the atrocity that they committed. This is the state of your spiritual being before you know Christ. You're not getting out on your good behavior. You're not going to heaven on your good behavior. The atrocities that you've committed are so destructive that it's deserving of eternal punishment. Because you've sinned, you've broke the laws against a holy, righteous, just God. And it's deserving of the ultimate punishment. But by the grace of God, he's given us a amazing gift through his son jesus christ who gave his life on your behalf while you weren't deserving of it he went on that cross to bail you out of that punishment and if you place your trust in him you will no longer see death but you will see life an eternal life you'll be filled with the holy spirit who's your seal for the eternal inheritance waiting for you that no man can steal that no thief can take can rob away i pray that you know Jesus as your Lord and Savior. I pray that you trust in him. I pray that you understand that nothing that you do on, on your own, by yourself, is going to bail you out. You're not going to get out on your good behavior. It's only the good behavior of the man Jesus Christ that is going to be able to free you from the chains of death. So I pray today, right now, that you will place your trust and faith in Jesus Christ because time is running out. You don't know when your time is up.